Hey everybody, welcome back or welcome to Something Old, Something New Car Rips. I'm Lance. Today's Monday, so we're doing some kind of mix. And then I got some other things to share with you guys as well. And then I actually need your opinion on helping me with a pack war I have with my daughter, who the winner is. We were tied up with some packs and uh, got down to the last pack and we couldn't decide who the winner is because we both had pretty good packs. So we're going to have this Vault Card Club. If you saw my Saturday video, we're going to do, we, I did the basketball high rollers. Today I'm doing the baseball high rollers. So hopefully this turns out way better than the basketball high rollers because the basketball high rollers was not very good at all. So before we get into that though, we'll go ahead and get into this. So first off, we'll get to that. So here's the, we opened a couple packs of Don Russ Optic, a couple packs of Don Russ 2020, a couple packs of Don Russ DK, and then a couple packs of 91 Fleer, just looking for the uh, ProVision cards, really like the ProVision cards, so... So a couple packs were one, and then another pack was one, and then we got to the we got to the optic was our last packs we opened, and one got, one person had this is their pack, the two big hits out of their packs, the Jake Rogers auto rated rookie out of numbered out of 75, 41 out of 75, and this mythical Juan Soto, and then uh, the other person had an auto as well, Brock Burke, but not numbered. They had the hey Jesus Lazardo rated rookie. He had a pretty good outing this weekend. He only pitched three innings, but he looked really good. And a Mike Trout. So my question is, which pack out of those two do you believe? We'll go with pack A or pack B. That's really close. I mean, you got the numbered rated rookie. I mean, these are both kind of the same if they, this one wasn't numbered. So let me know in the comments below what you think. And then as far as, like, personal rips, I've been opening a lot of this 2015. And uh, I got this uh, Garrett Cole. I thought this was kind of interesting. If you look at the back. 2014 it says 11 and 5 and then you go down to his career and it says 10 and 7 thought that was interesting that it doesn't match up at all and these are some of the pack cell so the dk one with his D joe dimaggio purple the 2020 donors from one with his nico horner independence day i left these gavin luxes in here i pulled because i just thought it was interesting that a lot of these rookies aren't getting to play this year so you're like wondering who the rookie of the year is going to be and it's just going to be probably the rookies they actually get a player going to be in there so you've got Bo Bichette. Luis Robert, Jesus Lazardo, but who knows how long many outings he'll actually get. I got this Joe Morgan numbered out of 99. I thought that was a sweet card out of Topps Archives. We've got a couple of Jersey Kings out of the 2015 Donruss. This is really cool. Anthony Rizzo with a pinstripe there. Got this all time artist proof Diamond Kings Nolan Ryan. This Jock Peterson autograph out of the uh, 2015 Donruss rookie card, 29 out of 49. And this Jesus Lazardo Bowman flashback 1990. Thought that was a sweet looking card. And then as far as I didn't wasn't any team breaks this week, but I did buy a box of this uh, Pinini Golden Age. And he threw in a box from Papa Jay's, and he threw in a spa, pack of 1989 Donruss. I got this. This is a short print of Jim Kick running back. And then I bought these really because I like these three stooges. We only get one of these per box, so. Just going to probably buy the rest of the set online. And then my two hits were this Max Bear Jr. actor. I'm pretty sure that shirt's probably from the Beverly Hills Billies, but you don't know for sure. This Lafitte Pinclay autograph. He's a jockey. And then I won, actually won a pack of Top Stadium Club, and I actually got an auto out of that as well. So worked out pretty good. And then, like I said, we... We were opening some packs from the hobby store yesterday, we, so I went to the hobby stop, hobby, my LCS, one of the two, and picked up some, just some singles, Eli Manning, this Tony Gwynn's really cool, upper deck, 20, 2000, year 2000, top tribute caller, Stremski, a Lance Lynn, cause, just because he's got the awesomest first name in the world, this Dell Murphy rookie card, it's really in horrible shape, but it's it's there, it's not a center or anything, but a, it's only two bucks. Can't pass that up. A Dale Murphy rookie card. And a Dansby Swanson. I was looking for his rookie card. They didn't, he didn't have it. This is the 2016. So this is actually before, after his first Bowman. But before his rookie. So can not get anything there. And then I packed, actually picked up some eBay pickups as well. So I got this Dan Marino. And this Frank Thomas Bowman. Don Mattingly, 96 Fleur Ultra. I thought that was a sweet looking card. A Gordon A. Word. Alonzo Morning and Tim Hardaway. And then, like I said, I got uh, one of these Golden Age cards. But I'll probably just end up 
getting the set from somebody because it's going to be a lot cheaper. So let's go ahead and get into this box finally. If I can find my knife. There it is. So I did get the vault pack in this as well. So we're going to get a pack of teams. If you saw my video on Saturday, it was a, basically a bunch of mem cards and one auto. You also get this vault junior pack. And also with these upper higher packs, you can get the golden tickets. So vault junior pack is for a kid. It was supposed to have some kind of auto and a mem card. And then one pack of cards for the kids to open. What does that look like? Triple play in there. I save those for my nephew when he's old enough. He's not old enough really to open them. Hopefully I get some good packs in here. Uh, you can request things like you don't want certain types or you do want more, you know, like, hey, more tops or more Bowman or whatever, and they'll try to get in there. And I did say uh, I didn't really want any Bowman, so let's see what we got. Elite, Heritage High Numbers, Diamond Kings, 2019 Optic. There's a Bowman Chrome 2014, a Top's Finest pack, and another Bowman Chrome. What year is that? 2015, so. And then this is the Vault Pack. This replaces one of your packs. And it's supposed to have our hits in there. You, you can tell them what your player players are. I think I put like uh, the Mets, like Daryl Strawberry, Dog Good, and then Kirby Puckett and stuff in there. So let's go ahead and get into this. So 2020 Pro Debut. So none of these guys, I think, was it Joey Bart was on the roster? Or maybe it was J.J. Belide. One of the catchers for somebody is actually made up. Oh, it looks like we got an auto in here. So already starting out way better than, <laughs> than last time. Nixon Nunez for the Marlins. So that's cool. Sam Huff. I always like to look at these cards. We do have a local uh, single A short league season affiliate. So I like to look to see if I can find their cards. Especially with not having any minor league this year. A lot of those guys should still be short season next year. So good chances if I had their card to take it to the, down there and get it autographed. So we got gallery here. Not really opened a lot of gallery. Freddie Freeman. Shohei Atani. There's a masterpiece Mark Guire. That's pretty cool looking. And a Trent Thornton. So some of these cards kind of different looking to me. The artistic card. Here's an Elite 2015 Elite. Just five cards in here. Not sure who our big star would be out of here. I guess a, maybe a Jock Pearson. Uh, who else? All right, another another auto. Raw. Ibn, Ibn is 21st century. Don't know what that is, but so we already pulled two autos, so killing killing yesterday's or Saturday's box. Here's a 2019 Heritage Tops High Number. Don't have an open very much of this high number either. Or any of the 2019 Heritage really. It's not really there's a Richie Martin rookie. Christian Yellick, most valuable player award. He's having a slow start to his season i think he's one and 14 or one and 15 his one hit is a home run though so then i don't know anything yeah so that was kind of so panini diamond kings let's see if we can get keep see how many autos we can get out of this box that'd be nice i really like these all-time diamond kings these are sweet cards the press proof ones in particular they actually have those numbered now here we go buster posey oh clint's gonna be drooling there we go, four patch for that guy, so that's not too bad. Like I said, already way better. Artis Palette, Fernando's Tatis Jr., and Orion Sandberg all times Diamond Kings. Not sure if I have that one or not. Actually, we'll save those and do these Bowman Chromes. So 2014 Bowman Chrome. So all these packs, actually, I think we have some pretty good chance for the autos. I mean, we've gotten already gotten a couple autos, but these are some low pack odds for the autos. Can't remember what they are for the Bowman Chrome, but I think when I see the other boxes, they open like one and twelve or one and six, something like that. We didn't get anything. The best card, uh, I don't think we got very much anything. Dom Nunez, first Bowman Chrome, maybe. 2019 Optic. Looking for that guy, Vladdy. Let's see what we got. Oh, there's an orange card in there. Corey Kluber. Blake Snell. Numbered out of 99. 88 out of 99. There's a Vladdy. It's peak performers. It's a cool looking card. 
And a Luis, Ort Luis Ortiz rated rookie from Baltimore. So, last pack, Top's Finest, five chrome cards. We've already gotten two autos and a mem card. There's a Glaber on the back, nice. Zach Green, there's another Shohei Atani. There's a Aquino, the rookie. Like I was talking about, the rookies, he's not getting to play at all this year unless something happens. And a Glaber, so not too bad of a pack. A lot of people really like these, the man insert series. By the time that these guys are going to have a chance next year, hopefully, so even the rookies are still still good rookies. They're just in crowded spots. Nico Horner, I mean, he plays shortstop. Who plays shortstop for the Cubs? Javier Baez, right? So... That would be a tough thing to get there. So, okay. So, this is a Valor Clark Quebec. Like I said, you can get this. It replaces one of the packs in the, the box. Uh, so, we don't really know what it replaced for us. But you tell them kind of what your favorite team is, your favorite players, stuff like that. And they try to give you some hits based on that. Let's see what we got. So, we got a Kyle Seeger. Another Kyle Seeger. A couple of Mem cards. We got an Ivan Wilson. A Reese Havens, a TJ Rivera. That's kind of nice. Tops Chrome. 2017. And a Kevin Plawaki. So the four autos in there. So that's definitely a better vault pack than we got yesterday. Yesterday or Saturday. Saturday's vault pack was three mems and one auto. This is four autos and two mems. So definitely oh, I didn't go through the pack values before I started ripping this all up. So this was $100. I should have said that first. Uh, seemed like we got a pretty good pack value. Like I said, the Vault Carb Cub, don't know what that is. But I know like the DK, that's like a $7 pack. That's like a $6, 6 $7 pack. A higher ditch, high number, that's... What is that? Probably an $8 pack. The gallery, I'm not sure about. I mean, these are all hobby packs as well. The Bowman Chromes, Top's Finest, that's a nice pack. So Definitely got some really good value this time. The, the Way better than the basketball one. I'd actually recommend this one. And not just because I pulled a couple of autos in and a mem card, but those are fun packs to open too. I like the pack selection in that. Let me know what you think below. Please let me know who you think won that pack where I didn't purposely didn't tell you which which one uh which was my daughter's and which was mine. But once again, these were two our pack in the B and then and here these three were in the other pack. So two really good packs. I like we only bought the two packs, so it worked out really nice. So once again, let me know what you think. Everyone have a great day out there. Good luck and take care.